So, did you finally go after that Bob feller? Well, I heard word he was in Kansas with John Wesley Hardin. So that's where I went. Where in Kansas? Abilene. Why do you ask, Ben? No reason. Was Hardin as fast as Ringo? Ringo was fast, but John Wesley was as fast as the devil himself. Hell, he killed his first man at 15. From that day forward, he had a price on his head and wouldn't back down for nobody, not even Wild Bill Hickok himself. <laughs> so <laughs> Sorry if you guys are wondering why I'm laughing. It's because Dennis has been sitting in his seat holding in a laugh since the cutscene was going for the past like minute. <laughs> he was just laughing at some stupid meme on Instagram. It literally was just finally found the square root and it's just a tree where you can see the roots and it forms a fucking square. Like what the fuck? <laughs> Was it that funny, Dennis? <laughs> Are you? <laughs> Jesus. All right. Well, sorry about that. Uh, but it looks like we're hunting, hunting John Wesley Harden. So let's get right into it. I dodged death many a time. Me and my radio voice. Oh, so we're finally using some quick shooters. The intention of finding that bastard Bob and collecting the bounty on John Wesley. I thought the Texas Rangers got heart. Yeah, <laughs> that's what they want you to believe. Gotta be careful here. It was cold in a witch's tit and a brass bra that night. A witch's tit? Past his loyal compadres. I'm sorry, I can't get over that. He said a witch's tit? The fuck? To the very same saloon we're sitting in today. Look around and imagine this place painted in blood. Harden was waiting for me. <laughs> Wait, I'm jumping a gun here. Let me back up and give you some background on this some bitch. He deserves that much. Don't you think so, Ben? John Wesley Hardin was a killer. Earlier that night, he confessed to the lives of 42 men. He was a bona fide folk hero by then, and had amassed a gang of armed miscreants and other assorted thugs. He and his men set up camp outside of town. And I was hoping Bob was among them. Shit, it's cold out here. You know, I just want to point out, he talked about how he killed 42 men. But if you look at the stats, we've killed like 200 already in the past few missions. So, you know, get on my level, Harden. How about that? that son of a bitch. They didn't ask why I was there. They knew. As most of them were wanted as well. I figured Harden was here somewhere, but to get to him, I'd have to get past his gun hands. I had to spill a lot of blood to find out Harden wasn't in that pit. Shit, shit, shit. Rousing in town with his closest friends. Harden's boys apparently didn't want me to reach the bull. Oh, shit. Guess that's what I get for being a hothead with a gun, but whatever. Better three hours early than a minute too late. I had to spill a lot of blood to find out Harden wasn't in that camp. 
He was carousing in town with his closest friend. Arden's boys apparently oh, didn't want me to reach the bull's head. Some were hightailing it into town to inform their jefe of my unwelcome presence. Well, damn. This mission's really humbling me, ain't it? Wait for it. Ba boom Shoot that son of a bitch! Gonna take the high ground. Would you call me? I wondered if Bob was among them. Shit. Oh, God, nope. Yes, I indeed did, because I'm Neo, bitch. I shot, son of a bitch. I wonder. Run! Hey, it worked. Noise. And I steeled myself for the fight ahead. For as good as I was, deep down I wondered if John Wesley wasn't just a little bit better. Hey, you never know sometimes. Before I could test my mettle against Harden, however, I would first need to dispatch his cadre of higher... No! <sighs> ah, oh well. Can't get them all. Most of these degenerates were beyond redemption, but John Wesley might have been a different story. I didn't learn until that we got later, a lot of enemies fact, across the town. Let's use our rival to pick them off. I don't know how I missed that, but whatever. Reload. Focus. Wait for it. Ba boom, got him. I think I already we're out of ammo, so I guess we're gonna have to switch over to the quick shooters. Suffice it to say, nobody there was happy to see me. Oh, I bet not. In fact, I felt a certain hostility. I was disappointed that neither Bob nor John Wesley. Like we cleared the place out. 
But that was short-lived, as a moment later I was facing down the fastest gun in the West. I thought that was Johnny Ringo. At least that's what I've heard. I felt a bolt of adrenaline. Ah, oh, shit. Or maybe that was fear. It's probably he fear, was well honestly. Known for his tricks, and I knew I'd need my own if I was ever to defeat him. So we're gonna pull our movie shit out of our bottom of our ass, and you'll see what I mean by that in a second. Oh, okay, never mind. Fuck, no, he is fast. Damn. I'm sure of it. Oh yeah, I bet you are, Silas. I just wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Alright. We are going to focus in. Let the speed and focus make its way. And watch as he pulls those two guns from his side. The first time I played this, when he pulled it out from his chest, I was like, what the fuck? Wait for it. No! Shit! Pull! Pull the gun! Pull the gun! Oh no, 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 no. Hold on. Neo! Matrix! Whoa, what the f- What? Hold on, wait a minute. I dodged that. What are you talking about? Wait a minute. Did I dodge it? I was certain I got that. Whatever. Now he's gonna pay. I guess focus really doesn't matter because it makes you fucking like have to wait until it fo refocuses anyway, I think. Let's hope I'm fast. Let's hope I'm fast. Shit. Pull, pull, pull. Oh shit. Oh shit. That man was faster than Grease Lightning. But being inebriated as he was, he didn't count his shots. And now. He was at my mercy. So he didn't die? No, I sent him to prison. Years later, after he was free, some restless Avenger took his life. Shot him in the back in a saloon just like this one. Anybody up for another beer? Ben? Well, accuracy still remaining the same as always. All right. Looks like we didn't level up, unfortunately. We were very close to doing it, so I was wrong about that. Whatever. That's fine. But let's actually just keep going the story. This story's really heating up now. See, I'm telling you guys, this game is great. It is fantastic. The way they tell the story and just all the aesthetics are just add-on to the great gunplay. Honestly, it's fantastic. But enough of my jibber-jabber. Let's move on.